Thomas Cook India invites the travel trade to learn and know the ground reality of popular outbound destinations in Hindi language at its next webinar on Tuesday the 29th of March at 3 p.m. Hotel Association of India discusses the outcomes from its recent AGM. We have tried to make this association uh, necessarily for creating awareness about the industry. That's, you know, industry as a whole creating awareness, not just creating demands here and there. Then we are, we are, we are about advocacy. We advocacy with the government, with the public and others about what this industry is. We are not making it demand based. We are making it a dialogue based. What we need is a mix of short term and long term approach. We had requested government that you have to look at the industry, which is 80% is of small and medium enterprises. In the future, of course, we say this has to be based on a long-term restructuring, and that restructuring has to be on uh, most important consideration is the liquidity support. We have asked for long-term structuring, restructuring of the interest rate uh, applicable to the and for that what we have asked for is the industry status as well as infrastructure status. Having worked with a lot of audit firms, I think this was a stellar experience and something you know which I shall always you know inculcate that we in the future as we grow as a brand that they will be our trusted partner and this is something what we would like Wallstar to do for us in achieving the growth momentum that we are already in, the phase that we are progressing. Tourism Fiji continues to offer visa on arrival facilities after reopening. Basically we are free of quarantine, so no problem there at all. Um, we continue, so Fiji continues to be a visa on arrival destination. So when I say a visa on arrival is actually just being a, your passport being stamped. You are not going through an e-application or any sort of formalities and that continues still and there are no changes to it unlike other destinations. And most importantly, it's free of cost, so you are not paying anything to get to Fiji. One above along with Move and Pick Resorts Maldives hosted a networking evening in Mumbai. We're catering to all different ages and all different types of clientele, starting from your honeymooners coming into the Maldives as well as your families. The Indian clientele and the market that cuisine is such an important part of your life as well. So we do cater to different types of requests as well. Um, we do have Indian chefs in-house so they're able to cater to the taste buds of the clientele also.